So I get this um, thing in the le a letter that says nationally known hitman Prophet J Prophet James, P.O. Box seven one zero six Silver Springs. I think it's uh, Maryland's, um, and it's got the postcode on there two zero nine zero seven, which um, says that the national headquarters is in Washington DC. Um, I checked out the telephone number and that goes back to uh, what do you call it? Spirit Nextel or something? I can't remember what you call that name now. It's a cell number on here. Not on this side. So that's a cell number. Um, Nextel Communications and the zip code is 10009 Manhattan, New York, somewhere around that area. Um, Glen Cove, New York. So, you know, I've started getting lo closer on the locations. I hope that you read this because um, it's, a, it's just full of crap. It's like a psychic scam. The person predicts that they're going to you're going to win some sort of money between a certain amount of time, and wants you to send it to this post office box. I'll um, try to get up this this a little bit closer, so you can read it. I would read it out, but it takes forever. And you have a look at the bottom. It says cash checks and money orders accepted. Hallelujah. Your friend in Jesus Christ, the great prophet James, world famous hitman. Uh, unfortunately, fellas, everything that I've checked out on this just does not exist. Um, I couldn't check out the post box here from Alabama, but when I did put in one search, it did come up with a, um, the address of a telephone carrier in, uh, what do you call it? Maryland. I could be wrong, but I did when I've done a post office box check. It came up with something in Maryland anyway, and it was a car carrier. Um, the person claims that in the name of Jesus you're going to win something, and when you do win it, send him half or send him a quarter, which is down there somewhere. It's pro. It's one of those recycled scams but I just couldn't find it right now I didn't do a word search um, but anyway read this I believe that it's not true my wife believes it's not true but I've never seen one of these before because I don't go in for the hallelujah scams so I don't sort of deal with them as often as some other people would down here there it is now read that in particular. And the cash money first, fast and everything. The person doesn't know you from a bar of soap, but they say they've prayed for you. Um, anyway, it's just one of those sort of crappy scams that I believe anyway. You know, some people just fall for it. I don't fall for it, but I think that, you know, these people are silly. Why would they start sending out this sort of stuff with it? And as I said, this phone number is a cell phone number that goes back to New York. It isn't actually in Washington, D.C., where Silver Springs says that it's got a post box there. And on the, this side, I think it's this side, it says that they've got other branches in the world. That means that's a load of crap too. I might ring it one, one time, but I'm really don't want to waste my time just to sort of see what, what the crap they come up with. Um, probably a good salesman with a load of crap. 